So this question looks like it's going to be a translate word problem question. Let's check it out. Um, translate word problem questions are typically four or more lines long, which is why I'm saying this might, might be TWP. And typically to answer these types of questions, we want to write down any quantitative and relevant information one sentence at a time as we're reading, um, and then manipulate that data or information in order to find our answer. So the first sentence here says the equation E of T equals five times 1.8 to the T power. So I'm just underlying that gives the estimated number of employees at a restaurant where T is the number of years since the restaurant opened. Okay, makes sense. So if the restaurant's been open for 10 years, I put a 10 here, replacing that T with 10. I do all the math here, and what would pop out would be the number of employees we expect that restaurant to have. Um, that's my understanding of what I just read. So the question goes on to say, which of the following is the best interpretation of the number five in this context. Um, okay, so I know, just from experience, um, that thinking of, well, what happens when T is zero, right, which means the restaurant just opened, I'd have a 1.8 to the zero power. 1.8 to the zero power is just one, right, because anything to the zero power is one. Because that's one, now I'd have just five times one here, in which case I'd get E of T equals five. So this five must be important for maybe the number of employees you should have when you first open a restaurant, right? So regardless of how long the restaurant's been open, because again, we have zero for T, um, you should start out with five employees. So that's just me kind of following my own method here of translate word problem to make sure I understand what I'm reading before I look at the answer choices and my judgment is clouded by the wording in the answers. So I'm pretty confident that this five represents the number of employees you start out with. So let's look at the answer choices and see what they have. Choice A, the estimated number of employees when the restaurant opened. Perfect. Love it. Choice B, the increase in the estimated number of employees each year. Definitely not. C, the number of years has nothing to do with years. Uh, D, the percent increase has nothing to do with percent. So choice A is our correct answer. The estimated number of employees when the restaurant opened. Perfect.